Hi students, today's spot diagnosis is a very important topic repeatedly asked in previous year papers and you all must be able to identify this. So first we can see skull x-ray showing multiple lytic lesions or multiple punched out defects which are usually 1 to 4 cm in diameter. Next, we can see bone marrow aspiration slide where complete replacement of the normal underlying bone marrow elements is seen with these abnormal plasma cells. Now, how do you identify plasma cells? They are characterized by an eccentric nuclear along with the presence of a perinuclear halo which is formed due to underlying Golgi apparatus. So, these abnormal plasma cells are showing multiple nuclei prominent abnormal nucleolus at places along with these deposition of abnormal cytoplasmic immunoglobulin deposition. Now last you can see serum immunoelectrophoresis showing a monoclonal peak in gamma region. So comparing to normal here you can see a monoclonal peak depicting malignancy. M for monoclonal, M for malignancy. Unlike a polyclonal hypergamma globulinemia depicting the underlying reactive conditions. So students presence of multiple lytic lesions on skull x-ray with abnormal complete replacement of the bone marrow with these abnormal plasma cells abnormal cytoplasmic immunoglobulin deposition and presence of a monoclonal peak on serum immunoelectrophoresis. What is your diagnosis? Multiple myeloma. Now students identify this body which is characterized by abnormal immunoglobulin deposition in the nucleus.